good evening guys last class we checked it out classical encryption standard and some of the ciphers are over now today we're going to check playfair cipher okay it is one of the method in substitution cipher substitution method we already know it the classical encryption have a two category one is substitution cipher another one is transposition cipher in the substitution cipher we have a six and there is Caesar cipher, Playfair cipher, Hill cipher, Mono alphabetic cipher, Poly alphabetic cipher, one time pad. The same way, transposition cipher have a right fencing method and a columnar method. In that, today we have we going to check Playfair cipher. Why we have a name Playfair cipher? Actually, this cipher invented by is Charles Wheatstone. Okay. His friend name is Lord Play Fair. So for this letter, he mentioned this algorithm as a Playfair cipher. So we have a name is called a Playfair cipher, and it is invented in eighteen fifty four. And this algorithm used in this. World War One and World War Two. World War One, it's the British government used it, and World War Two, it's the Australian government used this. And the Blefer is that mathematical oriented thing. It's coming matrix format. Okay, now we going to be uh, check out the structure of the Blefer cipher. Here, this algorithm will come under the five by five. Cast matrix. Okay, here you have to insert all alphabetic in that English letter. So if you fill it, we have a twenty-six letter. We have a cells twenty-five. So one cell have a two letter. That letter is I and J. Okay. So basically, Playfair cipher is the matrix cipher, and it can able to hold twenty-five letters. But our alphabetic we have a twenty six one single box going to be have a two letters the letters are I N J. Okay, is don't worry about this algorithm. If you check out one uh, example, you easily understand what it is. Okay, let me check on example. Here, if you want to do that encryption, we need a three ingredients. One is plain text. Second one is key. Third one is Encryption algorithm. Okay, here encryption algorithm is the Playfair cipher, and key we going to take as a Monon cherry. Monon cherry. And plain text you can take balloon. So now we going to perform the operation encryption. For that Playfair cipher alg <coughs> algorithm, first generate the five by five cross matrix. One, two, three, four, and five. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay. So what is the first step of that? Here, first we have to fill the keywords from left to right. Here we have a letter M, second one is O, third one is N, fourth one is A, fifth one is R, sixth one is C, and seventh one is H, eighth one is Y. So here there is no repeated letter. Everything is the uh, same. So you don't want to cancel it. In that in that case, if we have a Yam, um, that is yam monanchari like that. If you have a two, two same letter we have in that key, so you should not repeat the same letter. You have to take only words. The first thing is first step is over. Second step, what are the remaining cells we have? We have to fill with that alphabetic order which is not present in the key. Okay, already the A is present, and we have to take a B, and C is present. We have to take a D, E not present, F not there, G not there, H is there, I 
when we are mentioning that i it should come j i j k l m n o p q r s t u v w x y z so if you fill properly your statement is clear there is any mismatch over the smart trick you can able to identify the some mistakes in that okay our first step is over second step is over third step we have to take it on that plain text okay plain text we have some other rules first we have to split it as a pair so we have a b a l l o n that is our plain text then you have to take a splitation of that pair okay how we have to p a is a single pair l l is a single pair o o is a single pair and n is the pair okay in that first one is splitation second one inside the pair we have any repeated or same letter we have to use the duplicate or you have to add one letter is x now you going to be get the format b a l x and l o o n so in that case again for example we have a b a and x y and o n so again we have a letter m end of that so here you no need to use any x value over here but the end of the pair we have only one letter in that case you have to add one dummy letter x okay if you not need if you are filling like this we have a pair everything clearly you don't want to add any dummy letter to anywhere okay so our plain text is over our key is ready our plain text is ready now we going to implement our algorithm so algorithm we have a steps when we have a ba if you are taken you fall in in the same rows row this one is row this one is column if it is happen for example i am telling o a this two things are same rows if it is fallen in that pair we have to take the next letter of the row okay in that case o is here and a is here in that case we have to take the next letter of the letter so n will be instead of o and a will be goes to here r in that case same the plain text is m r r o r so o is next letter n and r next letter we have to return back the previous one that is m okay so this is why so row and the second one column in that column the same first column i am taking if you have a if you have plain text c l our cipher text will be c one letter further down here e and here one letter further down u so this is our cipher text in that case if it is comes in that last one again e e u u u e u is the plain text and the cipher text will be e will be l and u will be that next round rotation of first letter so that will be m so this is your cipher text and the third one is the square square or rectangle in that category i have a plain text f and s so if you check it will become like a rectangle box okay so in that case that diagonal thing you have to take f diagonal value is s and s diagonal value will be s diagonal value will be i and f diagonal value will be p so like that you have to select this is your plain text this is your cipher text sir here we have a i can we take a j yes you can able to take a j based on the programmer wish okay 
so this way you're going to perform the operation now we can check our example b a where the b b is here and a is here b is here a is here so it is fall on same column okay then one letter further down we have to take so b have a value i or j anything you can take a it will come for that rotation here so the next letter is x and again the next pair is l x l is where is the l l is here and x where it is x here so if you take it will be cut out rectangle box then l will be that u and x will be that s and l o l is here o is here again okay. the rectangle box so here l will be m n will be p and here o n it is fall on same row so o will be n n will be a so this is our plain text this is our cipher text this way you can able to perform that play for cipher algorithm encryption okay any queries put it in the command let me solve